how can you create a freebie that will encourage people to sign up for your email list and give value using Canva? So in this video, I'm going to show you how to create a nice, simple freebie that people will want to download and will encourage people to join your email list as a result. My name is Louise Brogan and I help people who want to raise their visibility online. I teach people how to get business on LinkedIn and around that, um, with all the work that you do on LinkedIn, there are certain tools and techniques and um, pieces of software that you need to help you get all your activity on LinkedIn to turn into um, potential customers and clients. So it's not just about using social media. We also want to focus on um, writing blogs, creating podcasts, building an email list, sending your newsletter, managing your diary, managing your clients. So without further ado, let's get into today's training. If you are enjoying the content I'm sharing on this channel, please do hit subscribe and the little bell so that you don't miss any of the future mini trainings that I share here on the channel. And let me know in the comments below if there are particular things you would like to know more about. All right, let's get creating your freebie. How to make a free checklist for a download for your podcast, blog, email, and whatever it is that you want to give people a free download from. So I'm going to use Canva. So you go to canva.com. I do have a paid account, but you can also use a free account. And what I'm going to do is we're going to start in here by clicking checklist, writing checklist in here and you will see they've got lots and lots of templates so if you see one here that really jumps out at you then choose it and that you're on your way so I will show you how we can uh, take one of these checklists and really use it for our own free download so we're going to take one and modify it for um, our own clients so let's have a look at this one here Office supplies checklist, definitely not what I'm calling mine. So how to change it? You go in and you start typing in whatever it is that you want. So mine is going to be a LinkedIn profile checklist. And I am going to change the font. So go up here and change the font to a font that you wish to use. There's lots of different ones here. I use Montserrat Classic for my fonts normally. And if you go here to decrease the font size, get it to fit like this. All right, the background here is not the colors that I use for my business. So I'm going to go into the color background here and select my branded color. Okay, so, so far you can see it's starting to take shape as something that I would use within my own um, business. Next thing we're going to do is change this text. So. Uh, profile photo and if you'd like a copy of the finished download you are very welcome but basically the idea here is that someone will watch my video about the LinkedIn profile checklist or listen to my podcast about what you need to update on your LinkedIn profile and then I offer them a free download and this is where I'm making this download that I'm going to be able to send out to people so let's just fast forward this little bit so far, so good. And uh, what I'm going to do is I've run out of, on the example, I've run out of the sample boxes to, to change. So you go to the top and these three little dots and you click on this little plus sign is to duplicate. So I want to pull that down into this section. And you see the cross wires that will let you know that you're putting it in the right place. So there we go. Um, update skills. And then do that again. It's a bit of a faff. Um, and if you have somebody to help you do this, then absolutely, by all means, uh, give this as a task to your assistant to um, please do for you and just check it afterwards. Um, so update, oh, request recommendations. Um, so basically, um, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to just put the final one. Um, just update, update, um, interests section. So that is the completed checklist that I'm going to give to people. I mean, it's not fancy, um, but it is something that people 
do you appreciate because they do want to, to literally run through a checklist that they can use. So the next thing we want to do is you might want to add your logo in somewhere. So if you have a, a logo uploaded, um, you might want to add that in or you can go down here and have a look at elements. So it could be that you want to add in a line in here. So you click on lines and let's see a dotted line. So maybe we'll put a dotted line and the little, so this icon here will turn things around. This one will move it up like this for you. Uh, let's make it a nicer colour. Um, maybe a bit of yellow. And okay, let's do the check. The check can also be everything can be changed colour. Um, there we go. So these are more of my brand colours. Um, and when you're ready, then change the name of it. Oops. So LinkedIn profile checklist. That's us. And then we're going to go to either here to download. Um, I'm going to set it as PDF print, download it. It's saving as LinkedIn profile checklist. And now we're ready to add that to um, a, a downloading page. Um, so that's what we'll, I will show you in the next video, how to add a page to your website for people to get your free download. If you would like to learn more about all of these little tips and tools that you can use for building your business online, make sure you hit subscribe on the channel and click the little bell so you don't miss the next video. Uh, thanks for watching. Do leave a comment below and let me know what it is you would like to see me create that's going to help you build your business online.